The 2019 CNBC Stock Draft. We've got a plane throwing pitcher and a Super Bowl champ, a mentalist, and a pro poker player hoping to read their opponents' minds and faces. A celebrity chef is cooking up his plan. Three Stock Draft veterans are back, and our champion is hoping to kick his way to a second straight trophy. You are with me live at the CNBC Draft Room. All right, so we're now here with Maria Ho, professional poker player. She's won over three million dollars in winnings. What's the deal for you? What's your pick? All right. Well, we are going to go high variance all the way square. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Square. Yeah. It is a variance. It's a bet on Jack Dorsey. Take us to why you like this kind of a pick in square. They launched a debit card. I think it's great for small businesses, for the mid-sized businesses. So it's probably never going to go anywhere. And I think there's a lot of potential upside, hopefully. You know, in poker, we are going all in right now. All right, guys. All in for Maria Ho. Welcome back to the CNBC stock draft. It's time for the sixth pick in the second round. I'm joined by Maria Ho and her partner, David Tuckman. Because everybody here behind me, by the way, has a brain trust except Kevin O'Leary, <laughs> who's just doing it all by himself. Uh, Maria, you went with Square last time around, said you liked the high variance. What do you go with this time? This time we are picking United Health. Yeah. We yes. feel like we're betting on the fact that government scrutiny over health care is going to subside, hopefully. And Guy made a great pitch for it on Fast Money last week. So we're sold. Wow. Thanks, Guy. Dave, anything nice. you want to add? To that? I, I'm just a huge Guy fan. And, I, you know, he sold me on it. And we had our Come scouts on. and our team look it up. And uh, like the that. research is there. Pressure's on, Guy. Okay. There's no pressure, Cal. There's no pressure at all. <laughs> it's shoot first, ask questions later. A stock for the last five years averaged 17 times forward earnings trade. At 13 now, the max was 21. People are losing their minds. Uh, they are. They losing are losing their minds. I, I completely agree with you. This is a big stuff. I love the fact that you watch this big stuff. Come on. Next pick is in. Don't oh. you? All right. The blue chip leaders making their third and final pick. Will it be a blue chip stock? Maria, what's the pick? With our third and final pick, we are going with. Apple. Wow, it finally comes off the board, guys. It finally comes off the board. Why? Well, I feel like with our first two picks, it was a little on the risky side. There's some uncertainty, but as a poker player, there's something called bankroll management. So now we're going to practice risk management and go with something that feels a little bit safer. It's solid, and with the services business that they're transitioning to, we feel like it could go up. So here's the question. Is that services business a key part of the thesis for this pick? Oh, absolutely. And we also wanted to correlate the pick with okay. Square. We figured the consumer is strong. At least they'll be strong through the rest of the year. Correlates well with, 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 with Square. So, uh, you know, we kind of figure we're going to win this with our first two picks. So just play it safe the third one. Game theory optimal, I feel yeah. like. GTO. We played Are this. you an iPhone user? <laughs> yes. All right, guys. iPhone user Maria Ho, back over to you guys.